You do realize that we can't actually be friends. What do you mean? Well, what I'm saying, and this is in no way, shape, or form a come on, but a man and a woman can't be friends. The sex part always gets in the way. That's not true. I have a number of men friends and there's no sex involved. No, you don't. Yes, I do. No, you don't. Yes, I do. You don't even think you do. So you're saying I'm having sex with these men without my knowledge? No, I'm saying they want to have sex with you. They do not. They do too. They do not. They do too. How do you know? Because no man can be friends with an attractive woman without wanting to have sex with her. So you're saying a man can be friends with a woman he finds unattractive? No, we want to do them too. What if I don't want to have sex with you? It's too late. The sex is already out there, so the relationship is ultimately doomed. And that's the end of the story. Well, do you blame me? That's what I'm saying. Is it my fault? Why? For pushing you into it in the first place. Law. Do you resent that? No. Because if you do, I mean, if you think I've stopped you from doing anything... Millie, like, what are you talking about? Just don't seem to want to know anymore. Hey. Well, look at us. We haven't said two words to each other all week. We don't talk. We don't have sex. What is it? I have a boyfriend. Where is he? I mean, apart from not here. Well, he was supposed to be here. He deferred a semester. You don't have to say anything. I know how these things go. People go to school and they drift apart. And sometimes they don't. Exactly, and sometimes they don't. And sometimes what you had still stays the same. Yes. And sometimes when you're thinking all these things, your girlfriend's at home sleeping with somebody else and has no intention of getting back with you. I'm so sorry. It's okay.